This is Master Joe. He's a Qigong master. You're watching him clear energy blocks throughout the body. Charles is recovering from a bad accident and is seeking help. The MD can come in and put things in order and line things up, but it takes a certain amount of personal energy or chi to, to heal yourself. What is Qigong? Well, it's a philosophy that employs several exercises aimed at balancing one's chi or bioenergy. Master Joe transfers energy from the atmosphere into his patient's body to help heal whatever ails them. He begins by filling a bowl with cold tap water, then lays dry paper towels on the injury point. Master Joe tears up a piece of aluminum foil and dips it into the water and wraps it into the paper towel. Then he begins. In minutes, the paper towel and foil become hot to the touch. We've asked a translator to speak on his behalf. When Master Joe produces energy and emits energy, he is concentrating on uh, uh, sorts of problems that the person is experiencing, health problems and what he is it's doing with his hot. energy and delivering his oh, energy to uh, them. What kinds of problems do you treat in your patients with Qigong? Master Joe treats people oh, with different problems, sometimes headaches, bone problems, or joint problems, cancer, tumors, all kinds of problems. Now you might think this is hocus pocus. Well, it's not. Master Joe's unique skills and techniques were learned over years of training. This Qigong master learned from his uncle, a Taoist priest in mainland China. Master Joe has been practicing for 50 years now. It works. Sam Goldridge has been a patient of Master Joe's for years. It seems to give me energy. I mean, you know, I come here sometimes and I'm depressed and uh, worn out. And after I leave, you know, I got a spring in my step and uh, things are so good. My astrologer told me that uh, According to her charts and with the Qi Gang, I'll live to be 95 and get shot by a jealous husband. Alternative healing takes over Hollywood in this Entertainment Tonight cover story. I'm telling you, it does not hurt. Bill Cosby went on Regis and Kathy Lee to show that he swears by acupuncture. Morgan Fairchild is a believer in Chinese herbs. And many other celebrities are turning to alternative forms of medicine to heal their aches and pains. The alternative therapies have radically changed my life because we can, we can catch things happening way earlier when you first start to feel something. When there's a little glitch in the body, you know, you can get it way earlier so it doesn't have to turn into a big deal. Soap diva Morgan Fairchild suffered from chronic fatigue syndrome until she discovered Chinese herbs. She thinks that there are many alternative cures available. Some people believe in aromatherapy, using scents and things to help balance your body. Uh, you can use different Chinese herbs, which have, you know, been passed down for thousands of years. Thousands of people are turning to the East. A new video called The Healers examines centuries-old Asian techniques to control pain and cure disease. Host and producer Margaret Wendt believes that so many people, including stars, seek these treatments because modern medicine often doesn't work. When people talk about cancer as easily as they talk about migraine headaches, then you have to realize that something's not, not right. Western medicine really isn't, isn't doing everything they should be doing. The Healers spotlights Master Zhou, who practices Qi Gong. His hands concentrate Qi energy to produce heat. Steam then rises off of his patients' bodies. Steven Seagal, Shirley MacLaine, and Franz Nguyen seek his seemingly magic touch. It's close to burning. It's, ah, ha, ha, Yes, it, it gets really, really hot. <laughs> This is actually heat that is coming out of his hand and is heating up the water, which is inside the paper towel. Alternative healing techniques are becoming more recognized by the medical community, and thousands of people from Hollywood to across the country are becoming converts. You can sit there and help them heal you. But believe me, when you meet a real healer, you'll know it. And these men help you heal yourself.